Вину. Ростову на Дону, вырази респект Хэппи пёс, да и ты самый лучший город на земле yeah. Крестный папа крут, как мафиозный Дон Он опасен, как опасен, злашный район По-отцовски добр тем, кто приходит с добром Мой дом, мой yeah. У нас в Ростове любители бейсбола больше, чем... Здравствуйте, товарищи! Это Эл Карлофф, back here again. Hello, guys, this is Эл Карлофф here with another episode of Let's Play Minecraft Season Odzin. And today we are playing, uh, this is gonna be episode 40, or, uh, episode 40. So, yeah, guys, it's our 40th episode special. Um, there's really nothing special about this episode, though. Um, I mainly want to show you which, what I have added since the last episode which has been a lot, um, so let's go and I'm gonna give you a quick tour real quick, but, uh, as you guys notice, I did collect some raw fish, because I made a fishing pool and I did some fishing off camera, um, actually I did a lot of building off camera too, and I also got a bunch of arrows from my newly created, um, what's it called, oh shit, I just forgot, it's my newly created dark room, which is kind of like a mob spawner, except it doesn't require like a, uh, like, a, you know what I mean, like a spawner or anything, so you could just build it and make the room dark and stuff, and then mobs will spawn. But first off, I doubled up these chests because I needed to store some extra crap here. I made a bunch of stone bricks, uh, that chest is pretty much full, and all that other crap. Let's just put the sand back here, in this chest here, and then I guess I could throw that over there. Um, but in this episode, there's a lot of stuff I have to show you guys, and a lot of new things I want to do. Uh, first off, let's get some melons. Just because this is like my main source of food right now. I'll put that raw fish away. And I think that should be good for this episode. Let's see. Alright. I am on level 22. Um, and let's just give... I'm going to give you a quick tour, guys. In case you guys are wondering what this thing is right here. I have wired up my wheat farm finally after like <laughs> 40 episodes or something. And um, yeah, now this thing dis dispenses water. And I'll be showing you how this works. Let me just get up here. Basically, when I flip that switch, this water bucket shoots out water here on both sides. Um, Like, you know, right here. And on each of these little uh, farm things. And then it goes down here and it shoots the water. Uh, oh, God, I'm getting serious lag problems there. But it shoots the water down this little chute down there. And I'll show you what happens. Um, I will give you a quick demonstration. Let me just go down here real quick. Okay, let's go to video settings, let's change it to 32, just so, like, everything could render real quick. But these are what I call the troughs. These collect all the wheat and seeds, and, um, as you can see, they're pretty cool looking here. Like, the water would just come down here and push it all, like, right out here to these little collecting troughs. That's what I've called them. And I also have one on the other side, too. It's right over here. It's kind of a weird location, like, how it, the water comes out here. But I could fix this in the future, so I'm not worried about it. And I also had some vines here. And if you guys didn't notice, I added some birch trees here. Because the birch trees are the national tree of Russia, if you guys didn't know. I have like four of them in my yard in real life, so <laughs> they're pretty cool trees too, I love them. Um, but anyways, I'm going to show you some other stuff here today that I have been doing. Let me just, I'm going to give you a quick test. Uh, let's go over here. Whoops. I'm getting seriously bad frames right now. I don't know why. Probably because of my dark room or something. With all that mob spawning. So I flipped the switch. Wait. Why isn't it working? Oh, jeez. Is it because I'm lagging or something? Let's see. Oh, my God. <laughs> that was serious lag. Okay, let's go. Flip it. And then the water shoots out, as you guys can see, and there we go. So, um, it do it is a little slow. I could probably improve upon this, like, right here, like, right where that stone is. Um, because it does move the seeds along pretty slow, as you can see. But, um, it does work out fairly well, and I am going to be keeping this. I actually could have used this a long time ago, but, I don't know, I was dumb enough not to. <laughs> so, I'm going to show you where all this collects down here. And also, guys, I've added this new dark room here, which took me forever to clear out. I've been working on this for the past two weeks, so, or not two weeks, like the past week and a half. 
Um, but as you can see, all of this is collected down here. Um, most of it didn't get collected because I shut it off too early, but oh well. Um, and most of the wheat wasn't grown, but you guys get the picture. Let's put that back up here. And we're going to eat real quick. And when I give away the world download, this is going to be the first place that you're going to start off at, I guess. It's going to be the message board or information. As you can see, it gives you all the information on my city. It says, Zdrasvite Tvarishki. Or, you know, like, welcome to my Russian city. Um, this project started back in February 2012. The city consists of five oblasts. Kremlin, Rostov, Moskva, Vladivostok, and St. Petersburg. Each oblast also has real buildings from the real Russian cities. And then, oh shit. I hope you guys enjoy this. And a ton of effort went into this. Build, enjoy. And then on these walls, I'm going to have a bunch of other information regarding the city project and all that crap. So, yeah guys, it's going to be a pretty cool thing when this is all complete. I hope to finish it very soon. Um, and yeah, it's probably been one of my most viewed Let's Plays besides Spyro 2. Or Sly 2, I mean. Um, anyways, guys, I added this sign up here representing the Kremlin district. Oh, shit, I hear something walking. Um, but yeah, that's how you say Kremlin in Russian. Um, there's a soft mark on the end right there. That's what that little thing looks like, a B. Um, but it says Kreml. That's how you say Kremlin. And also, I think these trees add a nice little edge to my city. And it makes everything look pretty cool. Oh, also, I have to go show you this real quick. In the Rostov Oblast, I've added something new as well. I've added these little roads here, as you can see. Right, They go along the outside. And then, um, I believe in real life, there's East Rostov, and then there's the West, connected by this bridge, which is... I forget the name, but I'll post it somewhere. And, um, yeah, there's a lot of uh, nice things in Rostov that I can build, especially with the Russian Orthodox Church, which is going to be my major focus in uh, the town square, which is, like, right over here. And yeah, overall, I'm very impressed with this city, how it's turning out. And now let's go down here and show you something else I've added, which is not really uh, major. I just want to show you it real quick. Let's go over here. And I'm going to change it back to uh, normal. There we go. Alright, so that's good. Hopefully my computer doesn't lag as much. Um, I've also added these little chests here. This is where I'm going to be doing my uh, egg storage. As you can see, I get a lot of eggs. <laughs> so I just pick them up real quick. And each of my um, chicken farms is completely filled up, so that's very good news. Let's just put that back in there. And those are eventually going to be filled all the way. Um, let's see, is there anything else to show you? I think this is pretty much it. And I am off today, guys, because it is Columbus Day, so that's why I'm off school. It is Tuesday, October 9th. Wow, geez. And yeah, I have, um, I almost fit it, finished Ratchet and Clank, so that video is going to be uploaded tomorrow, as well as Spyro on, I think, Wednesday, or Thursday. So yeah, we've got a lot of cool stuff planned. Let's go up here. And yeah, guys, I also have my Russian vlog series, which I'm going to be starting. Oh god. Yeah, I'm getting very bad frames on my computer. This world file is about 100 megabytes, so it's pretty big. And let's see. I'm not sure what to build today. Uh, oh, wait, I have to show you my dark room. This video is going to be kind of like a video special of me touring my city so far in the, you know, the Kremlin district. So let's go over here. Okay, just walk around. And this is my new uh, dark spawning room. Just go down here. This took forever to clear out, as you could see. Oh, shit. And, yeah, a bunch of mobs just dropped from here. And, uh, yeah, as you can see, they, they're just dropping right now. And this is a good way to collect arrows, string, flint, or not flint, uh, what's it called? Gunpowder and all that crap. So, yeah, they there's, like, um, these 8x8 spawning pads up there, and then that water goes and pushes the mobs to the center. And then they just fall down here. So it's pretty basic. I could have made it better, but, you know, it doesn't really matter. So yeah, guys, in this episode, we are going to be sort of finishing up the uh, Kremlin District. And I also want to do another thing in this episode. So let me get all my uh, supplies together, and then I'll see you guys back here. 
Okay, everyone, I'm back here yet again, <clears throat> and I have all my supplies together. I have my stone bricks, my wood, um, wood supplies and all that crap. So let's just get this all situated on my bar, and then I think we should be ready to start this episode. It is going to be a building episode, like I said. I need to start getting the city built and completed, and I did switch it to peaceful, mainly because I was getting, like, five frames, and now I'm getting, like, 20-something, so that's pretty good. So, I'm sorry, guys, but I just need to do it like that. Um... In this episode, we are going to be building my last building, which is going to be um, this building right here, which is going to be like a skyscraper. It's going to be fairly tall, so I w it will require a lot of, uh, you know, like a lot of building materials and stuff like that. Okay, so I'm going to start off on each corner, and this is going to be one of my tallest buildings, so just keep going up and up here. I want to make this, like, pretty huge, so I think maybe two more blocks one two so yeah this is gonna be my main like building when I have my nether portal it's gonna have a bunch of storage stuff in here and it's gonna be like the office building of the entire city so let's go out one more or two more I should say so yeah uh, I probably should have brought a bucket of water yeah let me go get that real quick um, I'll be right back here with a bucket of water so I could like not take fall damage Okay everyone, I'm back here. I removed that first pillar because I have a better idea right now. I decided to line this entire outside with hedges, and then it'll be like all grassy in here. And then I can have a center building that'll be a circle instead, like a circular tower. So I think that'll be a better idea, and it'll look a lot cooler. So let's go 1, 2, 3, 4, 7, 8, 9, 10, 13, 14, 15, 16, oh shit, 17... 23, okay, so I need to go 12 in, I think, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, seven. 12, this should be the exact center, okay, so this is where my tower is going to start, right about here, and yeah, I'm, I might have to remove that uh, stupid nether portal or whatever it's called, I might have to remove that in the future, so it goes in 3, 1, 2, 3, and then this is going to form around the entire building. So this is going to be like a real cool looking tower when it's all complete. And I'm just building this like by random. I'm not like following a template or anything. So just in case you guys are wondering. Let's go to. It's not going to be an exact tower shape, but it's going to be pretty close. Let's go like that. Okay. And let's go like that, I think. <laughs> I don't know if that looks right or not. Nope, doesn't look right. That looks kind of weird. Yeah, this is all, I'm going to get rid of this. Because I can't stand that stupid sound. There we go. Oh, shit. God damn it. <laughs> I fell in here. Is there any way I could get back up now? Uh, jeez. Let's do this. Let's be a cheaty a cheaty nebris. <laughs> okay, so that's good. Let's do that and just cover that up real quick. I don't care. Okay. So <clears throat> maybe I should make this a little bit this base is gonna be wider a little bit. Cause I want this to be a pretty f uh large tower. So maybe instead it could go out. One, two, three, four, five. Let's see, is that right? One, two, three, four, five. Yep, that looks good. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five. And then it's going to go two, two. That's good enough, I think. So two one. Two one. Okay. I hope they didn't screw up my nether portal at all, like three four like I'll never be able to get that again. I hope not. Okay, so that's gonna be the base of my tower. That's how it's gonna look. And then I'm gonna get rid of this too a little bit. Alright, so let's just get rid of a little bit of this. Oh, fuck. 
I keep screwing this up badly. I don't care, though. Um, alright, so this is gonna be the outside. And then I wanna have sort of like a, uh, this brick. I'm gonna be using this a lot. Let's get rid of my food since I'm playing on peaceful. Okay. So then I'm gonna put this right here. Or no. Just like that, okay. Alright, then I think along the outside I could do something like that. That looks good. Like I said, I'm not trying to make this perfect. It's just going to be a, a tower where I'm going to... It's like a skyscraper in the Kremlin. <clears throat> okay, so we got that done. Let's just continue on building here. By going up a little bit more. And I might not make this tower like 100 blocks tall. I'm just going to make it fairly big. So, you know, I have enough storage room and enough room to walk in. It is going to be pretty nice, though, I have to say, when it's all done. And I'm, I'm glad I made all that crap, too. For, uh, like all that stone brick I made all the off camera. So this is going to go up two more blocks, and then I'm going to place some glowstone and stuff like that. So far, it's three blocks high. And I'm going to place some glowstone maybe on the sixth layer of this building, so just to give it that nice little edge compared to all my other buildings, the same look. Okay, so now it is time for stone brick. Stone brick is going to be on every fourth layer. That's how I'm going to do it. Okay, guys, so I'm going to continue the same pattern for a while, and I will see you guys back here once most of it is complete. Uh, I like to do my building when I'm not recording, so... Hold on, guys, while I do some of this, and then I'll meet back here with you. Okay, everyone, I'm back here real quick. Um, I've sort of made some progress here. I'm about a little bit, almost to the um, Tsar's Palace restaurant right here. I'm almost a little bit taller than Hotel California as well. So, the pattern goes um, three blocks, then it goes to this um, nether brick, I think it's called. And then it goes to stone, and then um, on the edges, like right here... This is going to be glowstone, and then the next layer is stone brick. Then it goes up three more, stone brick, and then the on the edge it's going to be glowstone again with stone brick, and then the same pattern. So I'm going to continue this pattern again. Um, on the edges, just like right here, it goes like that on each of the four corners of this uh, tower. So the tower is not a perfect circle, but it is pretty good enough. Um, it's going to be fairly tight inside, but hopefully I could fit enough stuff in there. So yeah, guys, I'm going to be continuing the same pattern, and I'll see you guys back here when the tower is complete. So hold on, guys, while I go do some more work. Okay, guys, I'm back here, and as you can see, I'm taller than the armory building right now. And this is probably one of the, t the tallest building in my city so far. So it is going to be, oh shit, fairly, fairly tall. I almost fell off there. <laughs> that would have been pretty bad if I fell, because I have no way of getting up here again. Um, but yeah... This is going to be a very tall building, and once it's done, I think it's going to be called the Pushkin Tower, or something like that. Maybe the Victory Tower, um, and then I could have like a Russian hammer and sickle at the top or something. That'd be pretty cool. So, maybe I could call it the Russian Victory Tower, or something like that. I have no clue. Uh, but yeah, so, I'm not going to be doing any learning Russian videos, or learning Russian segment in my video today. Mainly because uh, I haven't been getting many requests to do anything like that. So, I think I'm going to go maybe one more layer or so. Because um, I want this to be not as tall as, like, like the tallest building. Like, as tall as that Russian flag there. But, you know, fairly tall. So, um, I want to talk real quick about my new series, um, Russian Vlogs, that I'm going to be starting. And also another series I'm going to be starting with Jonathan Wolf and... Um, uh, Sora Rocks and another one of Jonathan Wolf's friends. It's going to be Minecraft, a Minecraft series. So, um, on the Russian vlog series, I'm going to basically be talking about different topics that are in the gaming community and also stuff that's come up in technology news. And it will be featuring me in real life, like just like a vlog series, pretty much. Um, hence the name Russian vlog. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm going to be like using my HD camera and then I'm going to film myself talking about all that kind of crap. So it's going to be a pretty cool series. I've been getting requests to do that. 
because my one um a thousand subscriber vlog video got a lot of views and people seemed to like when I talked on camera um like in person instead so I will be doing that uh and I am out of bl uh blocks or what the hell am I saying <laughs> I'm out of blocks I can't talk today okay so let's go and this is gonna be my way down so oh shit no I didn't want to do that oh damn it is it gonna ruin my thing Let's see. Nope, it didn't go over. Yeah, let's just use it. So I'm going to be getting up by this way. Okay, so that looks... Oh my god, does that look cool. That looks awesome. Holy shit, this is one of my coolest buildings. Look at that. And then it could have it go up a little bit more. So, so far, I think that's pretty freaking epic. In my city. <laughs> oh god, my Ruski Gorod. Okay, so I'm going to go back to my house now and get some more supplies to finish the tower. And then I should be good to go here. Uh, let's go back up here. Man, look at my city so far. It looks freaking epic, doesn't it? Man, I've been working so hard on this freaking city. <laughs> you guys have no clue. But the cool thing is I show most of it on camera. Like, most of the construction. So, that's pretty cool how I do that. And I have no, I think this is probably the best city on YouTube. <laughs> I'm not just bragging. I think it's pretty cool. Let's just get most of my stuff here. I'm almost out of materials. I need to go and do some mining and crap. So yeah, let's get that. That's good. Okay, so I'm going to finish the tower. And also, I want to talk about that series I'm going to do with Jonathan Wolf. Uh, basically, we want to do something with Race to the End. I have to still ask Sora Rocks or Ryan if he wants to do that idea. Um, like with the Minecraft series or anything. So I still need to run that by Ryan just to ask him real quick if he wants to do that series. It's probably going to be separate on, or it's going to be on two separate servers. Because it's kind of hard to get like four people together to record all the time. Because a lot of people are busy and stuff. So it's going to be um, a very cool series. It's going to be race to the end oriented. But we're not sure on that idea yet. Um, I'm not sure if I'm allowed to announce anything about the series, but I am. <laughs> so if I get in trouble... I don't know, I'll just blame myself, I guess. <laughs> um, but yeah, guys, so I'm going to finish the rest of this tower, and that's pretty much how those series are going to work. Um, I think I'm going to go out about maybe two more layers or so like that um, with the same pattern as you can see here. So hold on one second, guys, while I go and finish this. Okay, guys, this is pretty much complete. I've met the level. I'm a little bit past the Russian flag level, as you can see, so this is high enough. I'm just going to finish up this top layer, and then this I'm going to call it quits for this video, because I want to work on this off-camera pretty much. So I'm going to just do this little edge work on here. This is going to pretty much bring out the layers of the city, or of the uh, tower, I mean. And I'm not sure what you, you guys could suggest a name down below for this tower. I'm thinking about calling it Pushkin Towers, or the Russian Victory Tower. And, uh, yeah, pretty much, like, so far in this city, it's... It's everything's coming along very nicely. I'm so happy how this is turning out. And yeah, season two, guys, you will you will love it so much. It's gonna be even better than this. I mean, it's hard to top of building a city in a single player thing. <laughs> so, especially one that consists of five districts. So yeah, and I I also, as you guys know, I met my one of my Russian friends on YouTube now. Um, I told you I didn't know his la his like full name. Um, but it is, um, Tikhon, or if you want to say it in Russian, it's Tikhon, and then his last name is Rozansiv, so that's pretty cool. Um, I might be doing a video with him, uh, re like, in the future or something like that, so, just want to let you guys know about that. Um, just giving him, like, a little shout-out out there <laughs> to Tikhon, or whatever. So, yeah, I'm just going to finish this top layer, and then I'm going to call this video quits. I think it was a pretty successful build. <laughs> I built a freaking tower. That's pretty cool. So, yeah. Just finishing up this last thing. I'm glad I had all this excess uh, stone brick on me. That's pretty good. Let's go here. And I have good news, guys. I will be most likely going to Russia next year. I'm going to be doing a tour. Like, Unfortunately, it's like more expensive to do just a visit. Like, You know what I mean? Just going there on your own. It's cheaper to go on a tour, I think. So I'm going to be doing a tour of Moskva, St. Petersburg, 
Um, hopefully Rostov. That'd be pretty cool to go there. And I think another city too. I'm, I might be going to former Stalingrad. It's called Volgograd now. They've like changed the name from Stalin to Volgograd. So yeah. Um. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode. It was pretty successful. Like I said in the building, <laughs> I'm just gonna light this up here. And I do like to do building videos, as you guys can tell <laughs> by the excess number of videos I have on building. So yeah, let's just go here. Might as well put it on every corner just to make it light up even more. And there will this will be an observing deck later on in the future. I just want to get this building built. It will all be filled in off camera, but so far I think it looks so amazing here. Uh, maybe we could do something else. I don't know. I'll think of what else to do, guys. But thank you so much for watching this building episode. It was so much fun to make. Um, keep subscribing, guys, by the way. I am almost have 1,100 subscribers. I will continue the work on the Rostov East Oblast over there. And then later on, I'm going to work on the west side of Rostov. Um, so, yeah, спасибо, guys, and до свидания. I'll see you guys next time with another epic video. Most likely Tuesday or, or Wednesday, I mean. It's going to be Spyro or either Ratchet 2. So see you guys next time.